Whoa, that definitely shouldn't be sparking. We can worry about that after we catch our dragon. And convince Lady Hellbender to help us bust the church a new one. Before setting out on our quest, let us rouse our spirits with a Katathian battle anthem. What? Like now? You know what? Flark it. Let's do it. Uh, listen closely. Ancient Katathian is a powerful tongue with words that hold great meaning. All right, let's do this. <laughs> Shivering tit witches, it's cold. <laughs> That's not really how that saying goes. You want to correct me? Or you want to find Fing Fang Foom and save the galaxy? I want Fing Fang Foom. And the galaxy saving thing, I guess. Assuming Hellbender even goes for this. Lady Hellbender will go for it. Okay. Well, I ain't seeing no foam poop. We should look for Katathian hunt markers. Testaments to the grave. That was too close. <laughs> the legends of raining fire are true. Any other legends we should know about? Legends of glorious death. Well, as long as it's glorious. So many of my people before us. Someone remind Drax we ain't come here to die! No one's dying! We're taking Foom alive. We're handing him over to Lady Hellbender alive. And we're getting her to help us take on the church's armada. So in this plan of ours, the armada part is where we die? All right, Drax. Let's channel some of that excitement into this rock. Ah, I shall pretend it is the head of Fin Fang Foom! Great! Drax just shattered the skull of the thing we're supposed to capture. Bye-bye, Galaxy. You have nothing to fear. They say that his bones cannot be crushed. I am Groot. Groot says he wants to take it all in. Take your time, buddy. Might be your last chance to take anything in. Think Foom's in there? If fantasy books taught me anything, it's that dragons love to hang out inside mountains. I am Groot. Groot wants to know if those books said anything about catching dragons. I'm sure it had something to do with teamwork and trust. <laughs> you can't remember the details because he didn't read the whole thing. I read a lot of different dragon books, okay? And there was always a mountain, and the good guys always win. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no one writing a book about us. Anyone else bothered by the cold? I think I see something up ahead! Look, my people were here! Didn't we see these in Drax's memories? When men- That's a lot of brave Katathians. After Thanos raised Katath, my people were left broken. Physically and mentally. Their exodus led many of them here in great numbers. Uh, so, how many of these hunters came back? None. They were all victims of Fing Fang Foo? Not victims. They came for the ultimate battle. A truly glorious death. They came here wanting to die, didn't they? Most Katathians believe that in order to reach paradise, Ultath, you must live a life filled with purpose. Failure to achieve this results in banishment to Sarduth. The bad place. It is not a place. It is non-existence. Kinda like what's gonna happen to the whole galaxy if the church gets its way. Indeed. So, are we sure the Milano's gonna be okay? Because if we end up stranded here... The Milano should be fine. I wouldn't worry about it. And even if we do end up stranded, we shall live like kings off the meat of Fin Fang Foom. Go wild! I really hope this lady opened a plan to 
Okay, so on a scale of 1 to 10, how much bigger and stronger and scarier is Foom gonna be than the thing we just fought? 10,000. That's what I figured. No one said this was gonna be easy, Rocket. Right, right, but 10,000 times Quilt, Drax is the literal one, remember? Obviously our chances of pulling this off suck. A lot. Gamora, I'm thinking I can get a pretty good vantage point from the top of this thing. Okay, just be careful, Peter. I can see the whole crater from up here. Maybe Foom's not in the mountain after all. Maybe he's down there somewhere. You tell us. I mean, if I were a dragon, I'd definitely want to stop around down there. Legends do tell of Fin Fang Foom stalking Maklu's greatest caldera. Good enough for me. We can probably work our way around the edge and find a way down. You're up, Drax. Impossible! Yes! It's full of meteorites. Just warn me if you see death coming from above. And you let me know if you see it coming from below. <laughs> You would see it coming because you are low to the ground. <laughs> yeah, I got it. Thanks. Good morning. Could you, uh. I was in the mood to cut something. Whoa, get a load of them claw marks. It's gotta be Fooms, right? He's even bigger than his legend. So, yeah, uh, when we find him, let's avoid the claws. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we need to cross here, too. Okay, I'm thinking this is step one of a multi-step solution to get across this chasm. All right, and what are the next steps? Still working on that part. My sister used to paint places like this. Hell worlds? Frozen landscapes. You expect me to believe that Nebula, scourge of a hundred worlds, like to paint pretty pictures? They weren't pretty. They were sad. I could clear the rubble from that ledge, Peter Quill. I just need something to throw. How about Quill? Final step, Drax. If we can topple some of those rocks, we got ourselves... Ah! 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 Glorious! I swear, I've never seen you in such a good mood. Because you have never seen me on the Great Hunt before. What about our quarantine zone mission? Drax, I know you've been waiting for this a long time. Enjoy it, man. Thank you, Peter Quill. I must admit that with everything that has happened... Everyone get ready. There's something up ahead. Pretty sure it sees us, whatever it is. Great. More foom food to deal with. Do not underestimate anything that survives the perils of this planet. Should have 
good advice. through a moment. Since when is that a thing we do? What if we're too late? What if Raker finishes what he started and the ritual... Then we're doing all of this for nothing. Not for nothing. If our final act is to challenge Fin Fang Foom, it will be an honorable final act. Eh, I don't do final acts. I'm a survivor. Let us hope we are not too late. All right. Let's figure out a way to get through here. We're in a rush, apparently. There. See? More... Bomb in his peaks. This planet's starting to give me the creeps. I keep thinking Foom's gonna claw us from behind. Fin Fang Foom is a legendary beast. Legendary beasts do not claw from behind. Maybe not. Smart ones do. Let's just say we do catch Fin Fang Foom. We're just gonna drag him all the way back? I'll call the Milano over, and we'll hook him up with the tow cables. I'm assuming he can survive deep space. Foom Fang Foom hunts multiple worlds. Perfect. Mark! Way too uh -oh. close. They say that Fin Fang Foom uses the planet's treacherous surface to test would-be adversaries. Oh, Lady Hellbender legends all over again. Well played, Kakarantara. How do you know? Hello? She's an assassin? I bet she's gassed all kinds of famous people. I have no idea what you're talking about. Uh-huh. Anyway, let's go, Quill. Use them fancy guns of yours to freeze the source. So here's an idea. Why don't we lure Boom into one of these gas caves? Knock him out. Cowardly. I want full credit for this. Last time, Drax. We're not killing Fin Fang Boom. We're catching him to give the Lady Hellbender so she forgives us and hopefully helps us fight the church. <sighs> Seems complicated. <laughs> down a legendary dragon with the fate of the entire galaxy at stake. I ain't gonna hold this up. Wow. I'm impressed. You really conquered your fear. Yeah, well, it ain't about me no more. Drax, buddy, you know what to do. I shall render it rubble. Instead of giving her foam, any chance Lady H might settle for a few of these? Whatever they are. I'm thinking no! Think so. You owe me one, Quill. If you missed them the first time around, here's more. It's a breathing room, Groot. Hold fast. Do you think we still have time to stop Breaker? Uh, anyone ever tell you, you got an enchanting voice? Are you Groot? I'm not being mean, I'm serious. I 
loving the initiative. So to look. So to look. Held out all Morgoth. So flounder God. This is definitely in Drax's wheelhouse. Don't leave me hanging. Dalmak, Dalmak, Soltak Blondergaard! Knock it down, Drax. I will gladly assist. Him. You will be more resilient than a boulder, Peter Quill. I know. I'm just trying to be positive. Why? I think it's a team building thing. We require no further team building. We are the perfect team. Eh, we're okay. That's high praise coming from murder, Mom. Honestly, after everything we've been through, there's no one I'd rather be doing this with. I farkin love you guys. Ugh, gross. Some things are better left than that. Think it's Foom? More likely it's people. Great. Maybe they'll know where he is. Or they'll attack us on sight. I could probably infiltrate the camp, look for weak links, make an example of the right person, bleed them out in front of their crew. The shock of it will cause confusion or maybe even surrender, and we carve through the rest. everything okay? We didn't really talk after your, um... The killing my sister thing? Yeah, and other tangential topics. I'm fine. Ish. Okay. <sighs> Peter, there's a good chance Nikki's already lost. No. I don't accept that. And if she is, I know I'll be the one expected to make the hard call. She's my daughter. But I'm the killer. We both know that. It's not gonna come to that. And if it does? If it's a choice between her and literally everything else, Peter, you'd do anything for someone you care about. And we both know that I... We both know that you would as well. Which is why you're exactly who I need to bring my girl home. Alive. I hope you're right. So draju to plug. Heldador Morgoth, Soltas Flandergoth. Finn Fang Foom, you seen him? 
Big wings, nasty teeth, purple shorts. What do you mean, purple shorts? What, I heard he wears purple shorts. The ancient legends do tell of such a thing. See? This one. <sighs> Let's see those things in action. I'm on it. Melt that one, too. And that one. people I care about are in danger, and then I get this feeling. Oh, I get it. It's like uh, faith energy. No, it's not like... Relax. I believe you. I am so jealous right now, Quill. You should be. Fortune smiles upon us this day, my friends. Ugh. Well, does it burn? I can't... Jump! It's like this magic mud stuff I used to make as a kid. There is nothing magical about mud. You haven't been to the spa in Contraxia. I have not. You don't really strike me as the spa type. Like I said, magical. Step aside, mortals, and allow the Meltonator to do his mighty work. That's a terrible name. Got a better one? PD hot guns. No! Captain Fireball. Not even a fireball. It's more like a uh, heat glob. Captain Heat Glob. Nope, no. At least it ain't quite as cold in this cave. You're the one with the fur. Root's practically naked. Root don't get cold. But he's a big baby in the heat. Hey, we're all flammable. One more time, Groot. I am Groot. Just about there. How did you know your guns would work back there? They've saved us three times already. I mean, how did you know they'd melt that ice wall? Oh, uh, I... didn't? So we could have just as easily died horribly. Yep. <laughs> 